I'm Ryu Ikeda, a 17-year-old introverted dude who's all about manga and video games. Uh, I think it's about time to sleep. What was that sound just now? Someone's under my bed? Could this be a freaking burglar or something? For now, I gotta be real quiet, real sneaky. Wait a sec. I caught a glimpse of that hair. No doubt, it's Hana. But seriously, why is she under my bed? <sighs> Ryu's bed. It's got Ryu's smell. This is way too much. Huh? She's like totally tripping. <laughs> but seriously, you're so clueless, Ryu. Seems like you haven't got a clue at all. My stealth skills are on par with Snake. Nah, it's all too obvious. If this was a game, alarms would be blaring by now. Hmm, let's just, like, ignore this for now. Noticing her would be kind of pitiful. But seriously, why is Hana doing this weird stuff? To get a grip on the situation, let's start by recalling what's been going on lately. A few days ago. I'm back. Wait, what are you doing? Can't you tell? I'm playing a game. Duh. Not that. You just got out of the bath, didn't ya? Your hair is still wet. Huh? So what? If you're gonna play games, at least dry your hair first. Don't blame me if you catch a cold. Jeez, you're so annoying. Stop acting like a big brother. Hold up. I'm just genuinely worried, alright? For real? That's seriously annoying. Ugh. Oh, look! Got a new item! Seriously, what's up with her? She used to be so honest and straightforward. This is Hana Kato. She's my sister. Well, not my blood sister or anything. Five years ago, we became siblings when our parents got remarried. Hey, how long are you gonna lock yourself in your room? Mom and Dad are seriously worried, you know? Because! Living with someone you don't know all of a sudden is impossible! Jeez, whatever. I'll lend you this. Huh? We're gonna play a game, a multiplayer showdown. Just so you know, I'm pretty good. I've even won national tournaments before. No fair! I can't win against that! Winning or losing doesn't even matter, seriously. Come on, if we play together, we won't be strangers anymore, right? You and me, we're friends. Uh, yeah, that's right. Back then, she used to be much closer to me, but now... You're cramping my gaming style. Go somewhere else. All right, all right. The next day. Did you catch yesterday's Tokisuku? It was amazing! No kidding! The hero working out and shouting love lines caught me off guard. Totally! This super outgoing girl is Ron Tenshin. We've been stuck in the same class since middle school, and she's basically a fixture in my life. A real blessing for talking manga. Hey, something up over there? Huh? In the hallway. Sounds like some commotion. And now that you mention it... I've liked you for so long! Will you go out with me? <sighs> wow, Hana! How many times is it this month? Confessing here? This dude's got guts, huh? Wait, isn't that Hana? Still as popular as ever, it seems. Back at home, she's always gaming like a slob, but at school, she's a whole different person. She's a sports and fitness beast, even though she's just a freshman, and she's the campus Madonna with her own fan club. That's the other Hana. Well, at least she's got the looks going for her, even if that's about it. I have no intention of dating anyone right now. This stuff's a real pain for me. Try reconsidering. I'm serious. You're annoying. I'm turning you down. Get lost. G come on. Ooh, ouch. Got rejected, huh? Harsh. There's got to be a better way to turn someone down. You sure about all this? Aren't you feeling a bit conflicted as her brother? Huh? Nah, not at all. Our parents have different last names, and not many people know we're siblings. But Ron, who I've known for a long time, is an exception. Hana's just my sister, plain and simple. I've never looked at her like that. Hmm. So, it wouldn't bother you if Hana started dating someone else? 
Of course not. It's none of my business. But why do I feel a little uneasy about it? Ugh! Those two! Acting all lovey-dovey in front of me again! And so, that's what's been going on, but... Hmm... No matter how much I think about it, I just don't get it. What's going on with Hana? Sitting on top of me. It's irresistible. I guess I'll pretend to be asleep. If I leave her alone, she'll be satisfied and leave, right? But ten minutes later. Hello? Are you awake? If you're awake, please answer. Ugh, gotta ignore. I don't want to deal with this. <laughs> He's already asleep. Do you? You're way too lacking in caution. This big bad wolf might eat you up, you know. Alrighty then. Uh, wait, why is she coming in? Wow. Do you? Your smell's even stronger now. Huh? Do I really smell that much? I'm a bit shocked, but that's not the issue right now. I love it. I want to eat you up. What? Your hair is so silky. <sighs> Still smells good. Wait, why is she hugging me? Oops, I should take it easy now. I need to leave my smell too. Hey, stop sticking your body to me like that. And then, after an hour. <sighs> Fully satisfied. Looks like I'll have sweet dreams today. Ugh, I got completely played with. I'll never be able to get married now. <sighs> what the heck was that with Hana? And does she actually like me? It must be some kind of joke, right? Maybe she's been teasing me since she knows I'm aware or something. The more I think about it, the less I understand. In the end, I couldn't get a wink of sleep that night. To make matters worse, the very next day... Hana sneakily invaded my bed just like before. <laughs> but he is really oblivious. Ain't got a clue, huh? Who's oblivious? I'm aware of what you're doing. Well, if it's come to this. <laughs> oh, wait. Could he be waking up? Oh, what should I do? Oh, I guess not. Jeez, don't scare me like that, you little... Ow! Hey, cut it out! It kinda hurts, you know? Oh, that was close. Too close. If I keep messing around, he might actually wake up. Alrighty then. Mm. This arm pillow thing is the best. Always wanted to try it out. She's doing whatever she wants, huh? My sis, she's something else. Snug feeling is seriously something. Might get hooked. Should I ask for this every day from now on? Wait, every day? Seriously? And then, from that point on, Hana's been showing up every single night. A few days later. Aww, gaming while cuddling is seriously comfortable. Too bad there's no Coke and chips, though. Why are you making yourself at home? Well, I mean, it is your home, but... On another day. Uh, uh, you sleeping face is so adorable. Kinda wanna munch on it. This girl saying that stuff again. He's not waking up at all, so a little snack won't hurt, right? Huh? Oh. Oh. <laughs> this is tougher than I thought. Uh, is she nibbling on my ear? See? Gonna nibble on you plenty. <laughs> Whoa, whispering by my ear is a major no-go. Sends shivers down my spine. And then, about a week's gone by since that day. He seriously sleeps like a log. Oh, I totally missed the right time to wake up. Can't just suddenly act like I'm awake now, can I? His carefree sleeping face. But he's not even worried about me. Huh? You two are all lovey-dovey again today. Can't stand it! Huh? Lovey-dovey? 
You've been mine since forever. I'm not gonna let you go to any other girl. Hold up. Who's she talking about? <sighs> Instead of someone else taking you away, I'd rather... <laughs> Wait a minute. Something's off. Ah! Oh my god. Can't hold back anymore. Is it okay if I kiss you? What? Here I come. Whoa, hold up. I appreciate your feelings, but, you know, we're just siblings. What? Oops. Wait, so you mean you were awake? When did you even... Um, from the start? <laughs> this is about today, right? Nah, more like a week ago. You seriously mean from day one? Sorry, I thought you hadn't figured it out, so I couldn't bring myself to say it. I... I can't believe it! So, you... um... about me... D -d -d don't get me wrong! I don't really feel anything special about you! I mean, the whole snuggling thing was me just being half asleep and mistaking you for a body pillow! Forget everything I said! Whoa, why the sudden change in your attitude? But, like... Maybe once in a while we could still do the arm pillow thing? <sighs> I'm like, so heading back to my room! Hey, wait up! Hana! Oh, she's already gone. After that, things got super awkward between Hana and me. Hey, could you pass the soy sauce? Mm. Come on, Hana. Mm. Ignoring me like this is harsh, don't you think? You can't possibly hate me this much. Look, just leave it in there. You're in the way. Uh, alright. Thanks. Huh? I'm just letting you know. It's not like I'm doing you a favor or anything. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Jeez, this is how it's gonna be forever, isn't it? The next day. Ugh, how am I supposed to handle this with Hana? It's not cool leaving things like this, but every time I try to bring it up, she bolts. What's up? You sit down. Well, things been going on between me and Hana. Oh, that means I caused some misunderstandings between you and Hana, huh? Sorry for the trouble. Nah, it's all good. We're just friends, right? There's no way I look you that way. It's all in her head. That's kind of rude, you know? Yeah, but seriously, what should I do? What are you blabbering on about? Get it together! Ow! What the... Hey, what was that for? You're Hana's brother, ain't you? So quit moping around here. You got better things to do, right? Ron, yeah, you're right. I've got it. I'm her brother, after all. Just you wait, Hana. That night, I decided to have a real talk with Hana. Apparently, our parents won't be back for a while, so it's the perfect situation. So, what's up? A talk about something so important? Yeah, there's something I really need to tell you, Hana. Huh? Uh, okay, I guess. I can listen for a bit. See, we've been pretty awkward lately, and... I just can't take it anymore. Well, I feel the same too. So, like, I seriously thought about this. How can we keep it real, you know? What is this? Me and you. <sighs> Tell me your feelings. I want to play games with you. Of course. Wait, what? Games? Remember how back when we used to fight, we settled things with a game? The loser had to obey one command from the winner. How about we do that again? Well, even if you say that, I thought... Huh? Oh, it's nothing, really. So, what do you say? You're not gonna run away, are you? Huh. Bring it on. I don't care what happens. That's what I like. And just so you know, it's street lovers for the game. Of course. Just so you know, I'm strong, okay? I've trained a lot to be able to beat you. Huh. <laughs> There's no sister better than one who can beat her big brother. A few minutes later, the battle began. Take this, Rep you can! Not so fast, Star Shining Feather! What? You're using it here? I've still got plenty of special move gauge left. Grr. Hey, check it out! I nailed it! Thinking she got all sassy, but some things never change with her. Man, playing with her might still be fun. Alrighty then, I'm gonna pull off some sick combos. 
Hold up, that's a cheap move. And as for the outcome of the match, ha, I won. Ugh, didn't expect to get flipped like that. How's that? Don't underestimate the former champ. That's ancient history back from elementary school. All right, time to lay down some rules. Hmm. You're gonna tell me not to come into your room, right? I get it. Huh? I... No need to hold back. It's creepy having a little sis lurking under the bed at night. No, that's not what I... But couldn't help it, you know? Ever since we got into high school, you suddenly got all distant. Hanging out with other girls and stuff. <laughs> Whoa, who are you talking about? Don't play dumb, I know. You're super tight with that takoyaki girl. Wait, seriously? You mean Ron? She's just a friend. This is harsh. I put in so much effort to look fly for you. Huh? What are you talking... Come on, you used to hide those magazines under your bed, right? So I thought maybe you're into that stuff. Wait, seriously? That was back in middle school, and you've known about it all along, even under the bed? Well, I just wanted to know everything about you. You know, ever since we became step-siblings, I've always liked you, as my big brother. But when you stopped inviting me to hang out, it frustrated me, and I ended up acting all tough. I'm sorry. No, it's just, I thought hanging out with other girls might be better for you. My bad. Oh, so that's how it was. But it doesn't matter anymore. You probably hate me, right? This not-so-cute girl. You want to make it clear, don't you? Well, go ahead. Just reject me already. Ugh, seriously, why would I do that? Huh? My order, I mean, my request is this. I like you, Hana. I want us to be together. Huh? Seriously? I've cherished you as my little sister for so long. But it's not just that. I like you as a girl, too. I'm so happy. I'm really, really happy. Come on, there's no need to cry like that. You're overreacting. But I've liked you for so long. Hana. Uh, I love you so much. Yeah. How about a kiss? I told you that's too soon. And just like that, we upgraded from step-siblings to lovers. The whole school found out about it, and not only my sister, but even I became famous. By the way, the misunderstandings were all cleared up since then, and Hana and Ron became really close. As a boyfriend, I felt a bit lonely, though. Hey, hey! Aren't you and Hana step-siblings? Yeah, but... Tell us what it's like at home! Hey, let's have lunch together! Sounds awesome! What? Hold on, don't just... You're cozying up to other girls again, do you? Remember, you're my only sweetheart, okay? Hold on, I get it, so don't stick to me! Ooh, it's like an episode of a high school drama! I was left scratching my head, as if it was like a 2P color change in a game. Nevertheless, starting a romance that began from under the bed wasn't such a bad thing after all. Hi, it's me, Mel! Thanks for watching my channel! I'm super happy if you watch the next and other videos too!